world really can feel like. And so uh, what I thought on a poetry night to express a little bit of my encouragement for us not to sit and ponder and be so somber as we stare out into the universe <laughs> and wonder if it hears us or if we're listening or if we should put our antennas up to hear God and you'll strike us by lightning and it will be blistering our skin as we're looking out at the world so vast and wondrous and we're wondering if we're here because of a reason or because of the season just brought our birth and wondering if we should be pushed to uh, our, put our nose to the grindstone and instead we should realize that we just should roll on home and play till the cows come home too and don't worry about the picket fence we should stick it to the man cuz and hence and whence we should play with our grammar too because we made that up once and we can make it up against maybe it's a part of our mind but we could see as we look into the sky and wait for the sun to fade so we can peer into the stars that this place is ours and it should be a place for fun and joy, and we shouldn't be so worried about whose toy we're playing with. Or if I stole this pen from... Where was I last? From Berlin! Or if it's mine. You know what? I've found it, and it can be a way to take what's in my mind and put it out, and express it. I don't need to shout. I can whisper. Maybe if you hear, you're about to come a little closer. And maybe if you come a little closer, you'll realize that you can play with me. And we can play together. And we can be playing full of whimsy. If you can come and play with me, we can play with little doll bearings. We can play by taking apart things and staring them. We shouldn't be afraid to play. We should be afraid not to play. Anyway, so what I was thinking about doing was just coming up and improvising poetry to, to show you that we can all be poets. And the simplest one is you're a poet and you don't know it. Don't be afraid to be cheesy. I learned this from the TV when I was watching some Tamilian movies. <laughs> the three idiots. And the take it easy for the sea. Or was she? Or was she? Take it easy for the sea. You guys remember that? Because I do. And it impacted me. I was on a bus in Kerala. And everyone didn't care about a sight or a gaze. They were amazed. And I was amazed, because we could play for days, and everyone was just dancing in the streets like no one was watching, because maybe no one was watching. Who's one? Hmm. We're all basking in the sun. What's inside and what's out? You don't know until you shout, and then you can hear your own echo. I wonder if you're there or here, or if you even heard or heard. It doesn't really matter if you're weird. That's all. <laughs> the point is, go play with each other. In that, in that kind of way. <laughs> that all. That all. <laughs> well, that was more than I was talking for.